Hello everybody, my name is Craig Pennant and I'm the founder and owner of TechViews and Help and today I'm going to show you a quick solution on how to make a virtual router in case if my first method does not work for whatever reason if you can't download this program or whatever um, I'm just going to show you how to do it in command prompt. Now you need administrator rights in order to do this, but basically this is exactly how this program works. It just uh, makes it a lot easier if you can just press a button instead of having to type in code each, each and every time. So um, first off, if you are able to download this and run it and connect it through a device, the biggest thing I see that's blocking people from connecting to the internet is firewalls. So check your firewalls. And what I did to mine, because I actually was blocked on my own, is uh, just turn off all firewalls, then try to connect it from the device. And five minutes of firewall being down, you really shouldn't really have too much of a problem unless if you're in a business. But uh, pretty much uh, five minutes down, just check if your phone connects and check if it gets to the internet. And if it does both of those things, you know you need to modify your settings in your firewall. I'm obviously not going to go through all that stuff because your settings might be completely different than mine and you might be using some other firewall than AVAS and Windows. So, as far as what if you can't download that program or it's acting up for whatever reason, which does happen, and I've seen that, um, not crashing your computer, just can't get it to start up or whenever it starts up it gives you an error well simply all you have to do is go to CMD and a search if you're doing it in, in Windows 8 and CMD up here right click uh, both cases right click and go to run as administrator and um, the color might be different I just did the color and properties so don't worry about that let's uh, make this like that and what you need to do is the following and I'll have the code down below so you can just copy and paste it but what you need to do is N-E-T-S-H W-L-A-N show drivers Basically what we're looking for is a yes up here and we're, what we're looking at is the hosted network supported. If that says no then you can't do this so you might as well go somewhere else and not worry about this. But if you can do it then let's move on. What you want to do is enter in the following code.
and founder owner of Tech V Snoop. If you liked this video, if it's helped you out or anything, then please like, please subscribe, and please share. And please visit techvsnoop.com. I hope you have a great day.